Ruka, why I sleep on top of the nail clippers, dude? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, dude? Get on the cat tree. There how do you goes. normally? How do you guys normally stream Quick Clash? You restream Ryan or something? I stream myself, and then I'll have a secondary window that captures Ryan's Twitch stream, but that's muted. So you put Ryan's stream on your stream. I put Ryan's stream on my stream. That's all I wanted to know. That's all I told you. I'm gonna give it a try. Give it a go. Sure, you have my permission. I don't give a shit if I have your permission Dude, or not. Do you know how many times Ryan owes me like probably several hundred dollars in gas money, Chad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's true. I think it's true. Several you you think I owe you like three fill ups of your tank in gas. Easily. You consider all the, the treks free treks to subway and mickey d's in high school there's probably like less than 20 trips to subway oh get off your rocker it was only in senior year and even then we were going you know once a week at most no 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 right <laughs> piece of shit I, I i disagree quite frankly i disagree oh i oh. i dispute it I'll send you the receipts in the mail. All right, please do. I mean, no, there's been more than seven years, though, so I can't, uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to honor those, but we'll see. Did you buy Ryan a sandwich? Absolutely no. not. You piece of shit. Excuse me. Why would I? He should have bought me a sandwich. <laughs> I'm not going to buy you a sandwich for driving me to Subway. That's disproportionate. Well, maybe it's like the every, you know, five rides I get a free sub. That makes more sense. I was thinking... <laughs> He's got a punch card. It was probably about a dollar in gas. Uh, I lost. I'm the one who worked at the gas station. <laughs> you worked at a gas station? Dude, general store. I did it all. General stores? One inch per drive. One inch per ride. Six rides, six inch. Sounds like Ryan. Donkey donka, donka, donka. Hi, Dan. Dan, you're not. No. No. What? Um. Did you want him to be? Always. Why did you say hi, Dan, though? Oh, I just heard dunk the dunk the dunk the dunk. Oh, I yeah, see. I that's, that's a good that's code. That's a great code. It's a solid oh code. God. Oh, dude, this is a great discussion we got here. Someone in chat said, if you only pay for the gas price, you're an asshole. Which was a take I've never heard in my entire life. <laughs> that you should also pay your friend a, a, a fee for driving you to the restaurant. And, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I agree with that one. What about all the insurance cost, maintenance? That is the on that the is car. honestly insanity. And uh, don't your friends. Your time. friends yeah. <laughs> how, how about I'll I'll take the bus and you can drive yourself and pay pay your own car insurance. Gladly. <laughs> that works for me. I think there's Hello. a rule. Hello. If you're getting driven, yeah, less than five kilometers a week, it's water under the bridge. It was more than five kilometers, though. Yeah, no, I agree, but it, it was water under the bridge because it was in the early 2000s. Gas My, flowed like water. <laughs> oil was only $100 a barrel back then. <laughs> I think it's back down there. Honestly. No, it's at like $1 a barrel now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think the only time I ever okay, discussed RG gas money with friends was like if we like drove to concerts watch. or something. And then I think a, like, you know, a road yeah, trip, yeah, or drive this more than an hour long makes sense. Going. The thing is, I did, uh, I've driven Malph around a little bit as well, but he always just keeps talking about that time that, uh, I, could count on one I almost I could... killed him because, uh, oh he thought I didn't see a deer in the road, but I saw the deer in the road. He, okay, he said he saw the deer, he didn't do anything until I said It's because I was driving the Accord deer. Coupe, it has incredibly good brake sensitivity. You don't have to brake at the same time you brake in a 1993 Volvo station wagon. It's a sports car. Dad, don't listen to his lies. He was, Malph's a handle holder. He holds the handle in the passenger seat the whole time. That's not true. Ryan's the, uh, you know, the little, the one that's above the window, the handle holder. That's me. That's you. I hold the handle. I'm not afraid to admit it. Chat, you need to yell at, yell at Ryan if he can't, uh, if he can't hear me. I can hear you. If, no, if they can't hear me. They can't hear you. They should be able to hear you. They, well, they uh, might as well yell at themselves, except they won't be able to hear because they're deaf. <laughs> hear what? <laughs> Uh, say what? 
<laughs> Not much, what? dog. What's up with you? Uh, uh, Ryan ruined me. An unusual object to bludgeon someone to death with. General Sows or a taco? Hey, did you know that in some parts of the world, General <laughs> Sows, a.k.a. General Taos, is also called General Chicken? Yeah. yeah. What the hell are they thinking? It's, just, it's like general. Yeah, it's, it's, that's not what that word means anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's because people couldn't pronounce the second word. Mm. <laughs> like, it's probably true. A taco well, has one. Are things that I have downstairs for dinner. The soft or hard right shell? Uh, hopefully soft, but I haven't been downstairs to check out the what's going on now. Okay. You saying you have a soft taco, Josh? <laughs> I mean, maybe waiting for me. Have uh, have you seen the the white people taco night video? I no. have, but I'm gonna be honest. I kind of like white people taco. Oh, so do I. A little like cold shredded cheddar cheese, ground beef, and some old El Paso seasoning. Mm. There you was sure. a game show then. Yeah, <laughs> game show two is not for me. <laughs> I I did hear. I think I saw one quote-unquote white people taco night video and um, someone was saying they they put pickles in their tacos or something like that <laughs> and and then pe the every reply was like what and then all the other replies were like yeah me too or no no no, it wasn't pickles what? sorry it's olives like oh, like okay. black no. olives right out of oh. the can I was I was Dude. like pickles I can see that and then I've never olives. had olives I would I would eat olives in a tar I do not care Dude I, black olives Tex Mex man it's in there I like the I love black olives but like a squishy flavorless black olive in a taco I don't know about that I'm alright I'll I'll eat it yeah I like black yeah, olives in sandwiches but not in tacos dude oh, It's apparently like the that Keith guy from the Try Guy You're gonna have to back that one up i think he sang the song but white people taco uh, i'm not familiar with this <laughs> you haven't seen that? i know i've not seen that about. keith guy from the try guys singing a song about white people taco oh, night devices. it was great i was busy watching a real musical this weekend oh yeah you mm. saw it. <laughs> did you uh, <laughs> did you pay for it i did we have disney plus oh, must be nice. the name of a shampoo for hippies Weed poo or sunshine bravery? I think the uh, quiplash has just been broken forever. Yeah, yeah, me too. Which is unfortunate. <laughs> They're just like only allowing 50 or under people to join. Yeah, dude, well, it's they social gotta, distancing. They gotta, they gotta sell the new <laughs> quiplash, you know? <laughs> social People wouldn't respect He Man as much if, to gain his power, he held up his sword and shouted, I'm a hipster, or if he held up his sword and shouted, I have the nougat. We gotta warm up. <laughs> Lucky my answers were good. I don't, I don't need to warm up. This is like Jimmy Fallon tier right now. <laughs> I, had, I, had, I had like eight seconds. <laughs> I mean, you quiplashed it, so. I mean, I thought it was funny. <laughs> and there he said, I have the new game. I gotta be honest, yeah. I'm too young to you know He-Man, so. <laughs> but you're not. I only oh, know, that's what I know. <laughs> That's the only He-Man I know. That and Skeletor going through the mirror and then his hand coming back and cracking it so nobody can follow him through. Come up with a title for an adult version of any classic video game. Super Mario Lovers or Pistol Command. Super Mario Lovers is the laziest fucking joke. <laughs> I wish it was like Super Mario Brother Lovers. Like that would at least be interesting. It's a dead heat, dude. It's a dead heat. <laughs> yeah, wow. it's tied. Yeah, it's tied, so screw you, Apollo. <laughs> I'm just saying. All right, we're bringing it back for Yeah, two. we're going to be funny now. I don't know what the joke is there, but I'm going to hope that it's funny. You know, when you said now we get to be funny? Yeah. Let's put it off for a couple of minutes. We'll come yeah, back. yeah. <laughs> yeah Let's put the brakes on that. Yeah, can, we, can we push that forward a couple more rounds? The worst thing to say when trying to adopt a pet, you think this could fit in my ass? <laughs> or how long do I have to cook it for? <laughs> I give this the certification of, of an attempt was made. <laughs> this this one, uh, some real some real heart and soul went into this. The right yeah. one's a joke I could see someone actually making in a pet yeah. store. The left one is like... <laughs> it's the worst thing to say when adopting it, a pet. Dude, I agree. Like, I, I, I actually... 
I actually out silly Josh. I can't believe it. <laughs> the dumbest person in the history of all time. Your mom, lol, XD, or Damn it. seven blanks. Well, that's it, basically a no answer. So It showed me a different thing when I typed it. Did you put a bad word? <laughs> what do you mean? No, it was an arrow. Oh! Uh, <laughs> it, it, Ryan, that it removed the... Yes, How would it point at me? It like it's gonna no, point no, through gonna... the monitor? <laughs> you don't even know. You don't even know which side it's gonna be oriented. <laughs> pointing that was the gamble. gamble. The other answer, and either would have been funny. <laughs> he said that yeah. was the gamble. <laughs> <laughs> so good. The title of the most boring porno ever: Yorkshire's Missionary Adventure, or I guess I'm coming. <laughs> Oh god damn that's just <laughs> There it is. That sounds surprising though. <laughs> well, I, I, I mean I I guess. <laughs> that's all you know that's a quote from Yorkshire's Missionary Adventure. Right? <laughs> yeah. Or I guess I'm Coleman. <laughs> Pray they be horny. <laughs> Fucking what? That's from Dark oh. Souls. Yeah. It's Andre. Andre, pray they be careful. Don't get yourself killed out there. He sounds like he's from Letter Kenny. <laughs> it's very. I do put on my Canadian accent for Andre. What is a tree? What is a tree thinking all day? Why didn't I get that prompt? Squirrels in my ass again, or leaf? <laughs> leaf me alone. The trees have asses. This one does. <laughs> no, Josh, wait. Was that? Is that yours? Yeah. <laughs> It's the follow up on my. It's the follow up on my. That's your A game was to yeah. just make every answer something about it being in <laughs> someone's ass. Yeah. Let's see if it plays off. Yeah, it won. Oh, pretty, of course it will. Pretty upset about it, but. <laughs> oh my god. See, that's like. <laughs> you know, the first one might not win them, but the second one. Oh. A lesser known medieval torture device. The NLSS or the bruh? Come on now. This is just. Look, I ran out of time. <laughs> I had an idea. I was going to put down a bad movie on DVD, right. and then I literally couldn't think of a bad movie. The that's, core? That's, that's how my I froze. The, core. <laughs> the Adam Sandler collection. Joker. Joker. No, it has to be a bad movie that's not funny. Like. It's gotta be the most uninteresting, horrible movie. That's not horrible enough to be noteworthy. The Avengers 2, Age of Ultron. The worst pizza is doggy style pizza or doggy style pizza? That's, oh, that's a God. jinx. I knew it. Oh, I see okay. something. See what's on your guys' mind. Huh? <laughs> hey, you put blank style. You know, <laughs> you, you, you know what's coming up. Gungum style. Gungan style? <laughs> Gung Rob Gung is here, I would've style. put New York style. <laughs> Gungan. <laughs> Gungan style. Gundam? Gundam style. It's, it's Gangnam. How do you spell that? Uh, do you have your Hangul keyboard out? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, oh, it's G. I remember this one. A. Un. G. He's not typing anything, is he? Oh, that is a... Oh, I try to make up a word, but it's a real word. <laughs> <laughs> this is where you just, you just like, yell something in your head okay. with sound. <laughs> like, whatever comes out. I can't wait three, to see four, this one. Three, it's not three, that good, I just... One answer, or <laughs> Romano. <laughs> Ga a un -ga. Splurt. Flarmit. <laughs> Doof. Blork. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't Doof the name of uh, Cindy's brother who has sex with a vacuum cleaner in Scary Movie 1? Uh, I don't know. That was, his Urban, name was Doofy, I think, yeah. Urban Dictionary just says it's an adorable idiot. <laughs> Doofus. You're supposed to make Is it Romano just cheese? <laughs> Deborah. <laughs> oh, Romano. <laughs> Crash my Romano car again. It's not a good Ray Romano impression, but no, I liked it though. Mouth, Gabriel, they're trying to impersonate me again. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Then I go, 
Shut the fuck up, Raymond. We're trying to find the ice cream truck killer. Splurt. Look at that. I can't, be I can't believe that one. It won with 19% of the vote. Splurt is good. Might be like the closest final lash we've ever seen. That's like a mayoral election. We should have just who, used who, who Orb. The, who, Orb would have been a better one. Lady. Roller girl? <laughs> she what? came like 23rd. Was that her name? Her, she ran as Roller Girl, yes. Wait, in the Vancouver? Yes, correct. In what? the Vancouver. Hey I'm starting to think that uh, she's not all there. there you know? City. Yeah. Vancouver. Concrete jungles where dreams are made of. What about the dude with the Hitler mustache? Yeah, he, he shaved it because he got a lot of pressure for not... <laughs> People were like, if you're running for office, maybe you shouldn't have a Hitler mustache. And he went, uh, I guess you're right. There are better hills to die on. <laughs> <laughs> it probably would have stopped it before I even started it, quite frankly, but at least he did, uh... He's cancel country. <laughs> <laughs> cancel culture's gone crazy. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry. <laughs> There's a lot of oh, see, you, see you on live stream fails. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to write answers after that. <laughs> you guys shoot off any fireworks? You guys it, light any fireworks? Uh, no, I did not. Nope. Man, you, you guys just have no fun. <laughs> Zero fun. I, where am I supposed to shoot off? If Dude, I, I don't need if to. I lit like... fireworks. I'd literally catch my neighbors on fire. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There you go. I don't need to. I I go out on the balcony and I just watch other people do it for free. Fireworks are for cops too. That's true. You cops in Victor? You I got two to seconds. You, you have oh, to okay. yeah. I have to just. I have Let's to dis look. disclose that. Okay. Thank yes. you. Right. I don't I, like fireworks. I am, I am not a cop. I like big fireworks displays, but just like a dude shooting off a few in his backyard doesn't interest me at all. Agreed. Especially when you say it like that. Did you see the video of LA? I did. The, for the, from the air? Dude, I was insane. There's a lot of fireworks. <laughs> like, what the hell? What the hot trend in weddings will be in the year 2046? Not having them or cut the cake with a lightsaber. Chat's like, I shot a few off yesterday. Thank you, chat. That was, that was a joke. Yeah, into your sock. Yeah. <laughs> crusty. <laughs> Got him. How far is too far? No. Not far enough or when it's in my ass? <laughs> that doesn't answer the question, though. <laughs> it kind of does. Does it? Yeah. Sounds like someone who's ne never mind. It's like how you know how far is too far when you're putting on your underwear. <laughs> Depends the kind of underwear, though. Dude, no? hear me out. I got a thought oh, experiment for you. My dog is riding in there, man. If you made the the seam of the underwear out of adamantium, could you split yourself in half by putting it on? Is it if you just if you just kept pulling, you know what I mean? Is it a, is it a you know what I mean, though? I don't know. No. No. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. <laughs> Imagine if you made the bottom seam of your underwear unbreakable. Bottom seam. Yeah, you know. Okay. Just go get an iron rod and find out for yourself. Iron's breakable. Yeah, yeah it's not Adam. Adam With your hands? I don't know if you were strong enough or the bar was no. thin enough. No. No. It depends how thin it is. I mean, I crush iron cans all the time. When I'm done drinking my soda. So what's the the difference? Is a silver metal. Uh, <laughs> so and iron cans. Uh, the amount of electrons. <laughs> no. The weirdest combination of the weirdest combination of three items you could buy at the store. Six pack of six pack pack of matches and one umbrella or pressure cooker Vaseline salami. Even if you Could, put all six of them together, it doesn't make sense. Did, no, they're they're totally all fine. <laughs> I actually completely agree. Neither of these are that strange. <laughs> I mean, really, like Apollo, it just sounds like this is a drinker and a smoker who also is in the rain. Lives in Seattle. Yeah. 
I guess the other the one's going too agree. far, if you know what I mean. I just but... want the salami. <laughs> Let's get matches for free, though. You only even have to buy them. What? A completely wrong way to spell Jennifer Aniston. Oh, oh man. Oh, here we go. Jenna Wan uh, Blanamama Anvil Dropston. Or <laughs> Jen Stain. <laughs> You, you got me. took it and went like, oh, yeah, man. The, I, oh my it, god! When you've already had the perfect answer, what can you do but just go for it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know an answer is good when, like, three years after Bear makes it, it's still like relevant. The wickedly talented Jen Stain. <laughs> Jenna Wan, a Blana Mama, Jenna Wan, and a Blana Mama, and Rudolph. <laughs> <laughs> Something you do not want to find under your hotel bed. Cancel counter or a time machine. <laughs> Cancel counter? Dad, he watched Dark. Hey, somebody watched Dark. Apollo, hey, it's your answer. We get it. You watch Dark. It's not my answer. Uh, I don't get it. Or is it your answer, but it's a different you, dude? Oh, shit. Whoa. Careful. <laughs> now you're actually spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> it was my answer. I knew it. Cancel <laughs> culture. <laughs> How can you tell your new all vegetable diet is working? Your dick pops clean off, or you start shitting trees. <laughs> <laughs> what? I, that sounds like something my grandpa would have said. Like, you keep eating all those leaves, you're gonna start shitting trees. No, no, I'm about the dick one. How they... It makes no sense. It doesn't make no. any sense. Why are you laughing? Stop laughing. <laughs> it, it would make no sense, you freaking soy boy. <laughs> your, your dick's gonna pop off. Talking oh, about oh I get it. It's a joke about how uh, people on the internet think that if you don't eat meat for every single meal, your dick falls off. And next is I get it. Wait, I didn't even know that part of it. I just yeah, like, I didn't know about that. I like either. the clean off part. <laughs> Name a TV drama that's about a vampire doctor. Dr. Acula MD or Dr. Alucard? I knew that Dr. Acula was going to be on there. So I, I knew where you were going with it, and then I went to vote for you, but because the answers look so similar, I accidentally voted for Dr. Acula. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. This this prompt is just like, yeah. yeah. They, basically, they're, the prompt might as well be like, write Dr. Acula. Yeah, they thought exactly. of the answer. Well, the prompt is like, did you watch Scrubs? <laughs> I watched Scrubs. I did think of Scrubs when I was writing it. If you can't say anything nice, tell the truth. Or if you can't say anything nice, say it behind their backs. Oh, we got a whole bunch of liars on this side, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> what the abominable snowman does when he's bored? Builds a man-man or a bombin? Second grandpa answer of the, uh... Here's my daughter. Thank he's, you. He's talking about Lady Grey. No, my daughter. Adeline. What? Ab Abomin? Abom Abomin. Yeah, His Abomin? Abomin? What? He's Abomin. Abominable. Abomin. It's on the screen. Is this like a Jonathan Colton joke or something? No. I've seen a song about the Abominable Snowman actually having feelings. Sounds like the kind of guy that would do that. I don't know what Abominable means, so I figured he Abomins when he's bored. But it's also his daughter's name? No, that's my daughter's name. <laughs> what? A fun outfit to dress up the statue of David in. Borat thong, perhaps, or adamantium braves. <laughs> adamantium braves. Uh, that's how Borat would pronounce it as well. He spelled the word wrong. Very nice. <laughs> I have a chair. I have a chair. I have a, chair. I have a pair of adamantium braves. <laughs> the underwear is how you say the adamantium. Who is Adam? <laughs> and what? It Adam Taintium? <laughs> like Wolverine's uh, La Hooka? Like Jason Tatum's brother? <laughs> I don't know why he's Norwegian now, <laughs> but. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, what, yeah. What would make baseball more entertaining to watch? 
Yup County or it being the only sport still running? It's not, though. I forgot about marble racing. I was at a restaurant yesterday, and NBC was showing the American Cornhole Champion. <laughs> oh! No. Dude, ESPN apparently just played an Eagles concert last night or something. <laughs> Wait, the, the Eagles or the Philadelphia Eagles? <laughs> no, the literal, like the band, the Eagles. Really? Yeah. Cornhole's pretty great. I know your audience, I guess. I mean, it's it's great to play if you're drunk or at a fair, but watching it on TV and the, and the players had coaches. Oh, dude! What the heck do you even tell a cornhole throw it, player? Throw it in the hole. Corn, yeah. Cornhole is just like coarse darts. And now round two, yeah. The last <laughs> Point values are tripled. It's fun. And you'll it's like, okay, okay, you see that? You see that hole there? All right. See, what you didn't do is you didn't throw the sack into the hole. So what I need you to do is throw the sack into the hole. I mean, are there coaches? Like today. I mean, what, there's the esports that? coaches, so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's like an esports nutritionist. Is it like their coaches in curling, too, though? Can you say the same thing? Yeah? Yeah, fuck curling. The worst annoying person in a movie theater would watch the movie like a total shithead, be streaming on Twitch, eat chips, <laughs> Donald Trump, not be wearing a mask, or be the coach. I like that. Yeah, I shouldn't say Donald Trump. I should say Donald Trump. Just put a little extra sauce on the word every time I say it. The most annoying person in a movie theater would Donald Trump. <laughs> you know, does, how do you feel about that one? Do a sad read? Okay. The most annoying person in a movie theater would... Thanks, Mouth. You're welcome. Donald Trump. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he won an award and the person giving it to him didn't want to give it to him. <laughs> I did read the prompt wrong. <laughs> I, th I thought we were actually naming it if somebody would be annoying in a movie theater. <laughs> This is the greatest movie. Many people are talking about it. I got like almost all of the votes from players. <laughs> <laughs> I hate That's that I voted right. once for that. Eat chips. That was good. You didn't even get chips really at the movie theater. So That's why it would be annoying. They'd be munching through the whole thing. What are you talking about? People get the yeah, nacho, nacho chips with the. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Those nachos usually stale, though. They cool. By the way, I don't care. I, I got a bone to pick. Good, let's <laughs> check this out. This is wrapping around. It's going to take about 45 seconds, though. A couple of weeks ago, insulted Tim Hortons in an Isaac episode because they suck. They're getting investigated by the RCMP for giving over location data in their app they're not supposed to be collecting. Literally, like, a week after that, I was like, pizza, pizza. I insulted Pizza Pizza, and then, like, literally the day later, it was like, Pizza Pizza's been giving information to the cops without asking for a warrant. Then, like, in an episode that hasn't even come out, I was like, hey, you know what's fucked up? In Ontario, in ninth grade, they go, hey, are you stupid or smart? And you go, I'm smart. And they go, okay, you're going to be in applied classes, and if, you're, if you go, I don't know, I'm still figuring it out. Out. They're like, welcome to the, uh, welcome to the applied path where you don't learn any book smart stuff. And I said that shit's pretty messed up. They just canceled it today. I'm wielding unprecedented degrees of power right now, and I just talked about how movie theater nachos suck, and it's inexcusable. Why don't they make better nachos at the movie theater? I ask you. <laughs> some of my colleagues them in the cheese. some of my colleagues like the nuclear cheese oh my god you have a full kitchen at some movie theaters and some movie theaters merely have a microwave I ask you is this fair is this Larry Deep? it's me Bernie. Bernard it's Bernie I didn't interrupt you a single time you didn't and that bit sucked, so that's like no, incredible no. <laughs> no tell him get in your head he was just answering the prompts <laughs> <laughs> no, I was actively engaged in listening. And you got then, four seconds. Like, it got Fuck. too long, and then I started answering the prompts. A surprising thing to hear in a nature documentary. We're here at Anthrocon to showcase dogs, or oh shit, he coming. <laughs> <laughs> No, imagine David Attenborough said that. <laughs> oh shit. He coming. <laughs> One of the most beautiful species. <laughs> In all of the land. Oh, oh shit, he coming. Oh lord. <laughs> oh lord.
<laughs> he is Australian. You're absolutely right. <laughs> I think quiet Australian's a weird accent. I feel like usually it's like, all right, mate. Hey, uh, you get steady on then. You don't. You don't hear a lot of Australian whisperers. Is it just that would just be someone from New Zealand? Uh, that's right. Polite Australian. Oh, he's right. <laughs> a bad title for a self-help book. Man up, you little bitch, or just smile. Yo, the one on the left. Probably exists. Probably is, yeah. Yeah, like. un unfrick <laughs> yourself, grow the frick up, uh, yeah. It's a complete title. The art of not giving a frick. <laughs> the one on the right mouth that is like, I thought that was a really good answer. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like combined, it's the best answer. But it would be called, it wouldn't be just smile, it would be called like, Sonic. the power of smiling. Mother nature's yeah. one simple life hack to turn your whole life around. A sign you're pregnant with an evil baby. Oh my god. He starts punching or your vag grows a goatee. That I'm, That's one of the funniest fucking answers I've ever seen in my whole life. It's a community reference. Is it? Dude, yeah. Is all it? the evil characters, they just... Oh, the that's a trope from the Start. 1400s. <laughs> yeah. well, at the then, Globe Theater. Futurama, it was just the 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 chin thing. It wasn't like a goatee. The worst thing you could stuff a bed mattress with, the corpses or cockroaches. God, take oh, out every prompt that starts with the worst. <laughs> yeah. Every single yeah. one. Yeah. Get them all. Get them all. The worst thing you could put in your mouth. <laughs> a penis. No, I said <laughs> poison. <laughs> <laughs> Three weird things. <laughs> I hate that. <laughs> you won't believe what happened next. What's on what Satan's grocery list? What you don't want to find in your closet. <laughs> Number 23 will shock you. An image that would make the Sistine Chapel's ceiling more badass. Airbrush an M16 in Jesus' hands, or get that guy who redid the Christ painting. I, I got a good bid for you to build so off of this. What if we started calling it Sistine Chapelle? <laughs> Wait, is Jesus even in that one? It's a hey, chapel no. ceiling. Yo, did you see that, like, apparently three more paintings were redone in I, a very similar fashion? I did, I did. <laughs> By some guy who's, like, a furniture restorer or something? <laughs> he's just like, all right, I'll give it a go. They are all really? very bad, yeah. <laughs> They're terrible. Oh, no. <laughs> What Being in this world where there's maybe like seven billion fucking artists without <laughs> jobs. Yep. And you can't fight. You pick the one person who's like, I'm gonna, I'm a, I'm a painter. I will fix it. I like it. He's clearly Italian, but not so yeah. much as to you know be an offensive accent. Oh, he didn't even. I didn't even get to have Ryan read the title. Titanic two. Now we're all going down. Yeah, there you go. See, it was worth it. Titanic 2. <laughs> now we're all going down. No, that's more of like a July comedy. Titanic 2. Now we're all going down. And then they hit you with the stinger at the end where somebody like farts as the ship is hitting an iceberg. And then they go, was that me? <laughs> that's Mike Myers doing his Austin Powers laugh at the end. We brought Leslie Nielsen back from the dead. <laughs> oh. Anna Ferris, Tara Reed, <laughs> Christian Slater, <laughs> Dean Cain, <laughs> as Superman. <laughs> God damn it, Quiplash! The worst thing. <laughs> I got it too, buddy. Don't yeah, worry. I'm fucking angry, man. Yeah, I no, hate it. So I, I embraced it. I embraced it. Is it in you, Gatorade? Is it in you? In you? Is it in you? Can you? Is Up it and at you? them. Is it in you? Eat shit. Jiro, you're very early for dinner. Too early. Yo, Jiro, you getting some sushi? I mean, if sushi's gloopy food in a can. Yep. Oh, yep, I believe so. I love that you use the word gloopy. <laughs> I think gloopy it's the describes only way to What a doof. <laughs> <laughs> Unlike Maverick or Iceman, a really bad Air Force pilot. 
A really Fighter. bad Air Force fighter pilot name would be Fart Ship or Target Practice. Now, who wrote Fart Ship? <laughs> <laughs> because this is the name of the person. Not the plane. Not the plane. <laughs> and a plane is also is not so a ship. <laughs> no. uh, fart Ship. I wish I wrote Fart Ship. <laughs> fart Ship. Josh. Hit shit. I wrote Fart Ship. Did you know that you were naming the... The yeah, you were betraying Ryan, the central premise Ryan of the fart ship in a sentence, and I was like, "That's an answer I can use." I said the word "fart" and "ship," like those were the I two think, defining words of the sentence. Were, yeah, I think that they were neighbors, though. So, like, you said one and then the other, and I was like, "I can use that." <laughs> a great name for a nude beach in Alaska: tits and bush beach, tits and bush beach, <laughs> or iced tips. Oh, we're really struggling today. Work with me on this one. Work with me because we we can do this. We can do this. Frosted tits. Yeah. What? That's good. What do you need me yeah. to do for that one? See, build on it. Build on it. Build on it. Oh. Come on, let's get let's get the writers' room going here. Build no. Titanic yeah. two comes out in fourteen months. We gotta get the script going. Now those are what I call frosted tips. Okay, there's thirty seconds, but we got another frosted, frosted tips. We got another eighty-one minutes to fill. Um. Beach boobs. Okay, <laughs> well, I'll write it down, but <laughs> there's no such thing as a wrong answer. <laughs> oh no. I uh, don't even. I don't know if I can read this first one. Quite frankly. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> oh, wow. Just, just vile, and I don't stand for it. Uh, that reminds me of a YouTube video. Yeah, it does. <laughs> yep. You don't kiss the dog in that video. <laughs> <laughs> you've, you've got it. You've got it reversed. <laughs> oh my god! Mouth. Mouth. I voted. Oh, we that's did the, it. Mouth. That's the third tie that Mouth has had today. Yeah, the worst face. thing you could rub all over your face. Ah! <laughs> Satan's steamy, <laughs> blood-filled cum, or another dude's semen except you are straight. What a weird <laughs> qualifier. What's the difference? Well, it's basically like another semen, but you don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> what, a, what a strange... Strange. <laughs> it's okay. Now I he was he was playing the reverse bait card. I see now. I see. Love how you managed to get two no votes. Uh... Except you are straight. <laughs> if evolution is true, then why hasn't Jesse Plemons evolved into Matt Damon? If evolution is true, then why hasn't Banana evolved into Minion? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know who the first one is for sure. <laughs> Why has this been involved in two minutes? That's amazing. Thank you. Uh, you ever you know what that? got me was the, it's the, the lack of plurality. Why has it banana evolved in two minions? Oh my god. Ryan's bad right now. Sure. Get yeah, screwed, Ryan. Ryan. Your dork ass answer got whiplashed. <laughs> <laughs> banana. <laughs> Minion. <laughs> banana. <laughs> Minion. <laughs> the worst Don't advice work. your boxing coach could give to you. Take a couple just to see if he means biz or just kick him in the balls. You gotta know your audience, Ryan. Mm, the worst advice your boxing coach could give you. Um, suck his dick. Mm. <laughs> Excuse that me, streamer, one. where's the answer that says, suck his dick? <laughs> I had to look up Jesse Plummer. <laughs> the guy from Breaking Bad. Yeah, and then I was like, oh, it's a good joke. I had to Thank you. Matt Thank Damon you. Just to make sure I wasn't thinking of Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> no, uh, Matt Damon is uh, the guy from Ocean's Eleven. Mark Wahlberg is the racist. And that's all What's the difference? Fire up the scoreboard. <laughs> I had to look up banana just to make sure I wasn't thinking of Minion. <laughs> 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 uh, 
This is round three. <laughs> it's round not round. funny. Points are tripping. Kind of is. Banana. <laughs> That's what I was thinking of the Donkey Kong. Oh, banana. <laughs> Name of a new U.S. state you would never want to visit. Banana. <laughs> you can't beat my answer. You might as well just not type anything. Stop that, Ryan. So, oh, I forgot you're streaming my stream. <laughs> what are you doing over there? <laughs> banana. He wants a, I think he wants a banana. With your votes now. The name of a new U.S. state you would never visit: Garbage, Triple X, Florida, 420, Triple X, Minneapolis, and Alabama. Banana. New Trump. Oh my God. West Cosby, or. <laughs> <laughs> Mizuzi Annecy. <laughs> I'm voting for it because you got that so right. Um, yeah, no, it took no, a second. Good. It took a second. <laughs> you know what? Take all three of them. I was so impressed uh, by your presentation. <laughs> Except you are straight. <laughs> <laughs> Garbage. It got 2% of the votes. <laughs> Or oh, no. University of South Florida, 13%. Hingle me Kringleberry. <laughs> New Trump, 15%. <laughs> West Cosby. I was the only person brave enough to vote for it. <laughs> I got 20% of the votes. What's Thank in you. East Cosby? <laughs> <laughs> for you to find out. Mizuziana C. That leaves Minionopolis and Alabanana. 25% of the vote. I hate that that one won. <laughs> I hate it because Minneapolis is a fucking state. Nothing has changed. <laughs> 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 At all. Well, it takes time to promote our work on this fine platform. I will start with uh, Corey. Hi, at twitch.tv forward slash black bike. How about you, Sinvicta? Hey, I'm Sinvicta. We are doing the Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke run along with the Binding of Isaac and GeoGuessr with Northern Lion. <clears throat> That's true. Thanks for having me. That's true. Everybody. <laughs> Wait for that DLC to come out. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> it's never coming out. Every, every day is uh, it's the same day. You push the rock up the hill, you get it up to the top, and then it rolls all the way back down to the bottom. But they keep telling you, uh, pretty soon it's going to be a new mountain, dude. It, it, it's coming. It's, it, it, any, it's coming. Any day now, there's going to be the art. <laughs> new items. In the, game. the art is almost done. Because <laughs> that's what that game needs. <laughs> thank, thank you for having me. Okay, um, how about you, um, Apollo? Uh, so shy, you just have some dog, uh, just streaming, just, you know, I don't, I don't gotta tell you anymore. Video games? Trackmania? Trackmania Tuesday coming in tomorrow? Trackmania? I'm gonna go uh, 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 play it forever. <laughs> <laughs> How soon do you think he's gonna hit the uninstall button? <laughs> no, I mean, I'll play it again next week. We'll I'll get it. better tracks. How? What do you? What? What do you like? No, just talk about if, it later. If, How about you, Mouth? How about you, Mouth? 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 How about you? How about you? twitchtv Fox. He said Michael May L. Fox. No, I did not. <laughs> hey, roll the tape, Jamie. Roll that clip. Michael May L. Fox. Michael May L. Fox. Roll it. Discord is injecting letters. Roll that beautiful <laughs> bean footage. I'm probably gonna get. I'm gonna just say conservatively, on average, four forty-three kills per game tomorrow. I'm pogged. You wanna? We should bet on it. I bet that I will get forty-three kills per game. Per game. Yeah. Okay. And if you don't, what do um, I get? Well. I just want to make sure you're down for buying me back 42 times. Nope. <laughs> what, you're gonna you're gonna kill yourself 43 times? I he solved it. 
he solved it. Anyway, uh, how, how about you, Josh? None. I'm uh, good. All right. All right, goodbye. Um, Kate is not going to stream tonight. She's going to take a day off. So you are free. Basically, you do whatever the heck you want. Might I suggest go sit in the summer sun and think about what it means to be alive? Really, anything but anime is what I'm suggesting. You have my permission to do anything that's legal in your country except watch anime. You can watch anime tomorrow. It'll still be there, I promise. Just try and go on like one day. Just one, just one day, dude. Come on. You refuse? Don't call me Baka. I know what that means. Hungry. I'm not hungry. I had a foot-long cold-cut combo. Very recently. Sorry, I went to the Twitch front page. <laughs> Let me see what's going on here. I have an obligation to host people that were on the show. Is this man staying alive? Well, let me see if uh, Draskel's going to play more games, because that's kind of all I want to... You playing? That sounds like Dota. How about this? I will see you all next week. All right, probably not. How about this? We'll see. The Last of Us 2. Well... No current events discussions, please? How about this? I'm just watching the fight out here. Okay, I don't know. How about this? Uh, what about this one? Where's my black market at? Shit, 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 shit. Where's my black market at? How about, uh... <laughs> I gotta be honest. Cobalt, he brought the heat. With the with the 10 seconds that we, uh, that we went, I think he had the best audition, personally. So I'm gonna send him over there. I'm gonna send you over to Cobalt Streak. He, he won the audition he didn't even know he was a part of. And I'll see you tomorrow for Unity.